Hi everyone, it's your girl Elaine here with Jeremy to discuss the things that we dislike about Unison League this week. Hello. Let's see how long <laughs> this video is going to be. Um, do you want to start off? Do you want me to start off? You I can know start. you're not off. I of feel your... like I always answer with you can start. So Ew, go yeah. ahead. All right. So one thing I dislike about the game is the constant power creep and the I want to say free-to-play players are completely incapable of keeping up with whales. Obviously, there is a huge imbalance between whales and free-to-play, but it is very, very hard for the free-to-play player to keep up with anyone who's spending even a moderate amount of money on the game, and yeah. it's a little problematic. Like, I've been playing for nearly six years, and there are people who've been playing for, like, six months who, like, doubled my gear score just because they buy stuff, and I started off with gear when, like... Like, basically, 27 cost gear was in spawns and good when I started playing this game, guys. That is how long I've been playing this game. It's been a long time. Yeah. I feel like a grandma right now, but that's okay. Well, even, even I remember that. I remember... You you came around, like, 30 cost gear think, being good I think gear. 30, I think 29 and 30 cost gear was when it... No, because I remember... Aren't those the, the, the planetary ones? Aren't they 27? 13. 28 like and 29, and I think. Oh, was, I remember them being really good. I could really be good. wrong. Yeah. So, and so that's definitely It's been 20s. a while since those were good. They're yeah. in the 20s somewhere. Yeah. We know that much. Let us know down below in the comments what they're costing. I think they're 27. Okay. And I'm going to look really good when I'm right and you're wrong. <laughs> Whatever. But, I know a lot more other stuff. It's fine. <laughs> but, um, yeah. I mean, there, there's, there's definitely an issue with the fact that the spawn rates are so low. So... You might and be able to. And the cost so high. Yeah, yeah, and the cost so high. So it's like you'll spend a thousand gems mm -hmm. to get one or two copies of a monster, but like a whale can spend actual money and spend yeah. two thousand, three thousand gems and get like a fully in view or fully it awakened depends. version I of the monster. I think some people say that the average to get a copy is like four hundred gems, or by eight hundred gems they can get a full infusion. But I think sometimes maybe the rates are screwed because like I definitely have done spawns where it's like we spend eight hundred gems and we get one, and then there are other people who are like, oh yeah, I spent six hundred and I got four copies, and I guess they just get luckier. I don't know. That's I mean, an issue. You, they also have the ability, like with whales, they also have the ability to run multiple spawns. Like, I want to do all the spawns that are out. I can yeah, do the treasure spawn. I can do the step up. When, I can do whatever I please because yeah, I got money. Throw my money at the game. Yeah. All right, I'll stop. Yeah. When I, I mean, when I was doing my video that was everything wrong with Unison Lee, I discussed some things that I thought they might be able to do to change the spawn system. So plug that and it'll appear up and below so you can check it out. Up high and down low. All yeah. right. I know. You want to talk about your favorite? event you want to talk about your favorite event oh the thing that i hate more than anything else in the world <laughs> is raid i despise raid so much and whenever i see that we're in raid time i'm like oh i have to do this now for the next what was a week yeah <laughs> something like that yeah. and like i just i don't like i don't like how it's designed i think it's stupid like going through like monster after monster and then just basically coming up against a monster that puts every status on you at the same time and you just can't do anything is Unless you're a really stupid. good team with everyone there or something, which is not what yeah. we have. We have even if, some even if you have everybody there and you have like clerics that are able to clear stuff, they're just well, it depends on the team. you. There yeah. are teams that can get past it because they have a more balanced group and they communicate better. Yeah. We don't have that. Yeah. That's a lot of our problem. The other problem with raid, which I don't like too, is it's not like guild battle where like if you face like a lousy guild and you beat them in two minutes, you're done. Like you're there for the seven and a half minutes, eight minutes, fifteen, minutes, whatever it is, and yeah. you're just like, I got a life, okay? Yeah, I can't, that's all I'm saying. I can't always. I got a dedicate life. the amount of time to raid that I'm really supposed to, and you can't even like auto it or something like that because then you'll you, end up matching yeah. and then it'll end up. I mean, you could. Time. You still get credit, but you're not going to do well. Yeah. My least favorite event is probably Colosseum. I think, like, the system is just, like, so screwed up, like, with the range of levels of the players that can go in at the same time and in the same bracket. It's just not designed well. It's basically like, hey, look, you just killed this person. Hey, look, you just killed this person. And points are based off, like, A, killing other people and doing damage. And then it, when it's that skewed with gear scores and stuff, it's just, it's a mess of an, an event. Like, I, I hate that event. Mobius takes too long and it's boring. It's very redundant. But I am, I'll say they're, I'm happy that the devs are putting out more content and things for us to do. But I thought the ninja class was dumb. Like I thought, I, I don't think it's a very good class. I don't think it's strong. I don't think it has enough of an ability set to make them like particularly viable as a gameplay option. Yeah. I mean, when we come up against a, a team in guild battle that's like ninjas and morphers, I'm like, oh, okay, this is free. <laughs> like, <laughs> because... morphers aren't terrible, but ninjas are just oh god yeah the, i don't the, know 
there's some classes where you're just like you look at them and you're like why like why are you here <laughs> what are we doing and then the other thing is why do they think fishing would be a good addition to the game like in what universe does someone say you know what i want freaking fishing in my game give me the fish yeah why I mean, it's just like an absent-minded thing that you can do. More little mini games would be fun. Like more like the racing kind of mini games, yeah. or maybe we all get ponies and we get to go racing. Yeah, like I want a pony. I feel can like I have it... a pony? Oh, yes, you can. No, I can't. Not I in feel this game. like I feel like it would it, it would kill time. Like when you have nothing to do. Like yeah. if you're waiting for AP to regenerate, just like a little mini game. It's like a little racing game, or like you're saying, like with a with a, a horse that like jumps over fences and stuff. It literally is like no, one no. button. I want to jump on my horsey. I want to train a freaking horsey, or maybe a dragon. Can I have a dragon too? Sure. And a tiger. So you can just make and a panda. I need a panda. So you can dra you can train your dragon, panda, tiger, <laughs> and you can do obstacle courses and races and stuff. And so like a pet feature, but better. Yeah, like there's yeah. De there's definitely little little things that they could do that wouldn't require a lot of programming and would allow you to just like go on and play because like everybody's got those other games that they play like the little bubble pop or was it bubble witch or They're temple low. run or yeah. things like that like there's a lot of games that are like a little absent-minded fun games but if they put that on unison league as a little mini game it would keep people on unison league yeah they could play those things keep the players active when they're not doing anything they don't have ap the other thing i don't like friendship points i have like way too many friendship points at this point and yeah. you just use them on that spawn to get like stuff kind of if you're a noob like the but... furniture no no that's a different type of metal which i also have way too many of yeah. <laughs> but no the friendship points are the ones where like every once in a while they're like oh we'll actually put good gear in here but you're never around when that happens because there's like a finite window and you're, you're so used to them being like nonsense that yeah. you don't even bother thinking about it but there's basically nothing in there other than like stuff to fill out your encyclopedia if you care about that which i used to but i kind of gave up and it's just like why they just take up space. They look stupid. I don't know. That's uh, all. I so think that's they, everything for me. Uh, overall, I like Guild Battle, but I don't like the fact that Guild Battle basically just comes down to who wins the first unison battle. Basically, The yeah. vast majority of the time. If you win the first one, you're probably going to win because yeah. you're going to be able to take the major majority of their crystal down, especially if you have monsters like our usual lead monster, mm -hmm. like our usual lead set when we win on it, we pretty much almost always win because it's like it gives you immunity to karma and it gives you immunity to piercer and stuff so you can get through all of the, like, the punishments that actually mean anything and there's not a lot of strategy in between yeah. unison battles you need and more strategy yeah and it's and it's luck because like if you throw the wrong element and they th happen to throw the right element yeah i think it's better with the s bracket because like, what i understand is that the crystal is like a little tougher than the earlier things and there is more strategy involved but for anyone outside of s with a halfway decent guild it's not particularly exciting i think even in s people can do it too depending on like the rank of the guild what even are we in now we're in a I, I think we're in a still we're in a still we're just yeah. chilling in a yeah we're just chilling in a we were in s for a while though and it was basically the same yeah we're just chill now we chill yeah. it's okay is that is that your last complaint yeah, have we complained enough yeah i think it's okay. we've complained enough complaint. all right well let us know what you thought about our complaints down below in the comments and if you have any other complaints for the game what don't you like about it we always like to know what you guys think and if you like what you saw here today, please smash that like button until it's blue. Subscribe, ring that bell so you'll know what's up, and we'll catch you all in the next one. Bye, guys.